Well, this was the Facebook Instagram. Yeah, right? that's true. Yeah. And Instagram. <laughs> Yeah, I wanted to show you today um, the collection, the photo collection we acquired from Egypt. Uh, that's, that was collected by photographer Yasser Elwan, who's been mm -hmm. living in uh, Cairo for the past 20 plus years. And then he has collected these photographs from, you know, secondhand book sellers mm -hmm. or um, mm -hmm. antique shops over a decade. And mm -hmm. then he donated the collection. Well, these, um, you were saying you think they're from the 1920s, and that looks likely either the 20s or the early 30s, perhaps. And, you know, it's, it's interesting, because it, these are definitely from a sort of middle to upper middle um, professional class. And it's sort of a group that was, um, was known as the Effendis, because the men tended to be professionals. They were teachers. They were lawyers, um, bureaucrats. And... And you can see in this one, for instance, um, it, he's wearing a Western Western suit and a fez, and that was very much the the costume that somebody like the uniform that somebody like that would would wear. And can you tell um, in terms of religion, are they Coptic or Armenian or you know? Muslim? To be honest, they they could be any of them. Okay. Really, one might think, oh well, okay, they're not. They're not veiled, so they're not Muslim. But in fact, by the 1920s, upper-class Muslim women were um, were removing veils as well. And then we have this. <laughs> Ooh la la. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is very much within the, you know, as I'm sure you know, um, within the, the sort of tradition or neo-tradition of um, Orientalist yeah. photos. I mean, the sort of um, self-orientalizing, self <laughs> yeah. Now, here's one from somebody named Aisha. And she's saying, I'm sending this so you remember me because pictures of individuals remain um, uh, even when one day the body will disappear. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> so there you wow. go. <laughs> yes. That's deep. <laughs> That's deep. Yeah. Yes. But what's sad is that they ended up in, you know, in the market. Yeah. Just being sold. Yeah. So there's a bunch of photographs that were, that are addressed to a person called Kaukap. Mm -hmm. So I'm not exactly sure if maybe she was a teacher and her students sent. She could have been, yeah. Aziza T. Kaukap. Now this looks like it's from her... Well, it's odd because it's a little bit formal. My dear Kaukup, um, in the Oath Kodak, I, I'm always remembering you. Um, um, and please remember me because I always remember you. This is in 1930. Um, and then it's signed Ochte. Um, so sister. your sister. Now, of course, that could be used figuratively. Right. It's not necessarily... Uh, you know, but there but are two women who look alike, so mm -hmm. maybe yeah, this is be. not Kaukop, this is the sister. May, it could be, could be. I love trying to figure these yeah. relationships out <laughs> yeah. just from these tiny little clues. Is it a common name, Kaukop? Um, I think in the tw in the twenties it might okay. have been more so. Yeah, um, and of course it was used. I mean, it was. Um, one of the nicknames by which the famous singer Um Kulthum became famous. She was known as Kaukop oh. Ashark. Oh, and here they are at the seashore. Ooh, here we have a real message. Um, okay, this photo was done at Abir, which is um, one of the beaches very close to Alexandria. Maybe these are all the teachers of that picture, that group picture. Wa abla Aziza, wa abla Naamat, wa abla Fardus. Where is Kofa? I don't know. I'm giving, or I've given this picture to. My sister, and in this case, the term is shakika, which really is probably literal. It's, it's not not something one would use figuratively. Um, to my sister, Ebla Kaukab, <laughs> there she is. So she's not in the picture. Um, to be a, a memory um, for her of this trip, of this beautiful trip. It's so mysterious to I me. know, from your sister, but Ochtek again. Oh, what a mystery. I know. <laughs> well, Where you have to Kaukab? start tracing. Where is Kaukab? Where is Kaukab? Kaukab <laughs> may be the sort of, you know, she's the one 
She's the absent picture, the one who brings everything together.